In this screencast, we're going to take a look at some properties of spline curves. This presentation is similar to an earlier one that we gave on Bezier curves. The red curve that you see on the screen is an example of one such spline curve. The two green dots on the curve separate the red curve into three segments, each of which is a parametric cubic polynomial. These green dots are called the nodes of the spline. The yellow point represents the point on the curve that corresponds to the parameter value that appears to the right of the yellow point. Currently, that parameter value is 0 0.2, and in this example, it can range from 0 to 1, as we'll see in a minute. For any parameter, the yellow point is at the center of mass of the blue circles, which will vary in area as we move the point. These blue circles are called control points. As we move the yellow point, some of the blue circles will increase in size, some will decrease, and some will vanish altogether. So now I'm moving the point, and notice as we cross each green dot, some of the circles vanish altogether, and some start having positive area. And we can see this as we move all the way to the right, where at the very end, the last circle has area 1, all the others have area 0. The graphs to the side of each of the blue circles represent the magnitudes of the areas of the circles that are adjacent to those graphs. And those are called the graphs of the B-spline basis functions. Another way that we can experiment with the properties of splines is by moving one of the control points. Notice if we keep the parameter fixed, like in this case 0 0.8 or 0 0.083, and I move a blue point, the parameter value stays the same, but the shape of the curve changes. And so we can continue to experiment with this spline curve and watch the behavior of the graphs and the related behavior of the blue circles. And note the main thing to observe here is that any point, the yellow point, is at the center of mass of the blue circles, that is, of those control points. So thanks for listening and thanks for watching.